Oh, real quickie on the 74 hours 100 uh, seat. Done, the new seat is. Finally got done. The guy was backed up for weeks. The color, the upholstery color, did not end up matching the tank color. I think it was the picture I had on my phone. I think it was a little darker. I think I had it in shadow. And when we matched it by my phone, or else he used the wrong fabric. They're not the one, not the same vinyl that we picked out, but either way, it's done, it's done. Um, had a problem running. Uh, it would uh, start and idle okay. Didn't want to rev. Uh, exhaust was cleaned out, repacked. Um, put new points in. Didn't make it much better, and I know these are point timed. So I couldn't figure out what was going on. I thought maybe the uh, the, the cam lobe was worn down on the, the magneto, the inner cam, which is the only way that uh, the, the points are triggered. Um, so I pulled that off, and the <laughs> the woodruff key on the magneto was sheared and then it they had locked about 15 20 maybe 30 degrees off so it would run it would idle but it wouldn't it, it, it wouldn't rev it would rev but it would backfire and pop like a bastard it would exhaust it would it would it was just garbage so now with the uh the new woodruff key my lord hold on one second let's hand kick oh just about lost my arm Okay, <laughs> the compression kick on that thing now is nasty. So it'll now run and rev properly. Um, excuse the smoke. I just, like I said, I baked out the exhaust and there's still a little bit of residue in there blowing out of the exhaust that'll bake off. Um, yeah, so it's just fine time for finishing the wiring, final reassembly, and it's, this should be done in within the week, and uh, hopefully get a driving video on it shortly. Uh, if anyone knows of a wiring diagram, a proper one for a 74 RS100, uh, let me know. I don't want to dig all the wiring apart, but anything I can get is for the later model, which was CDI, different wire colors, different, uh, uh, different wiring harness a lot of it not all of it but a lot of it um, it's not like I can't dig it apart and figure it out but just looking at a wiring diagram would be a hell of a lot easier than figuring everything out wire by wire but anybody knows of one let me know thanks for watching